Well, let's get to it. Hello there, Internet. I am your host, the J-Man, and we welcome you all back to some Let's Play! Sailor Moon, another story we left off. We found a crystal or something. I don't know. I even asked Huega what happened last time. Probably silver or rose crystal, I guess. I think, yes, we think. All right, uh... Just expected. They took the rose crystal. So, we obtained one. One of the rainbow crystals. Hold on one sec. I'm just trying to get the guide up here. Uh, how much will it cost Destiny change? That'll be okay, Anshar. In fact, we're going to go and make even more changes. I'm going to borrow Kin Kishar for a little. Uh, Lenny Apsu, please change the destiny of this boy, Shingo Tsukino. Make sure that he never plays Minecraft ever again, because do you not remember that, Huega? Yeah. Uh, little... Do you not remember the whole thing, joke is that every time we go to his room, he gets mad because he was trying to play Minecraft. Oh, her He's like, get the heck get the f out of my room, I'm playing Minecraft! It's a popular meme, you'll see. He's the younger brother of Usagi Tsukino. Sailor Moon, who is trying to find Destiny. I think this is you. Shingo Tsukino is too near the Silver Crystal. Weakened, though it may be, it remains a force to be reckoned with. If I am to use my power to throw Destiny out of balance. Oh, so I'm sick as of recording. I have a really bad cough right now. It falls upon you to guide his fate to ruin. <coughs> Son of a... Damn it! Just when I said I was sick, not only that there. Lady Apsu, you don't have to change it further, do you? I promise. I'll bring you back to Silver Crystal. <sighs> huh? What the hell's this? Whatever you are, you're kind of cute. Where can I? Oh, are you hungry? Well, let's get you some food. And then I'm gonna be playing Minecraft. I have a. I built a sick house in it. Usagi. I'm sorry, I made you worry. Mono. Mono. No, no, don't make that face. I'm a little better now. See? Is that great, Usagi? My my room's back to normal. You know. You know the cost died? What do you mean? Hail Destiny was after you and Chibiusa's silver crystals won't die. I guess they're trying to put Tuxedo Mask out of commission? Why would you put Tuxedo Mask out of commission? He barely does anything. I mean, like I said, he shows up, does something vaguely helpful, refuses to elaborate, leaves. Hey, hold that thought. I need to take a soak outside for a bathroom break. Okay, hold on. Okay, okay. Well, right now, it's my line right now. Uh, with me out of the way, it could change history directly. Wait, guys, outside. Or the Yakuza. In the meantime, I'm gonna talk about some something funny to have today. So, uh, I went to buy a copy. Went to buy uh, Prince of Persia. Uh, uh, for the Lost Crown for Switch. But apparently, I noticed it didn't have there. But then I remembered something. Why not go to the back? Ask if they have any copies of the back at Walmart. I did that same thing when I bought. Uh, Ghost of Shiva. I bought Ghost of Shiva at my Walmart because, well, I was frustrated at GameStop. I like, they wouldn't answer their goddamn phone. So, out of patience, I just bought the game on Steam. I just bought. I asked the, uh, the guy at Walmart if they had any copies left over. Lo and behold, they did. Literally, the same thing happened to me today at Walmart. I asked they had a copy of Prince Persia Lost Crown for Switch left over in the back. They did! 
Probably gonna play that later. Well, what's Fuega's, uh back here? Maybe I'll just make some stuff about Among Us. Uh. Also, I even told Huega about Power World, the Pokemon clone that's with Pokemon with meets the Second Amendment. Uh. I'm a texter. Everything's okay. So, uh, oh yeah, also, uh, the Fort, the new Fortnite, uh, Solid Snake skin. Uh. I never thought I'd actually willingly play Fortnite until the Peter Griffin skin got announced. <sighs> God damn it, wake up. I should be a rude. I'll probably just call her. Oh, you there, Huega? Yeah, I'm back. Okay, good. Now I can resume. Mamoru had a line, but I read it for him. But I read it. Uh... Yeah. Go on ahead. Go on ahead, you honey. Explain. The four kings of heaven told me. This is my dream. Something is being born from the evil power of the comet approaching the future Earth. It holds the power to alter destiny. But some things it can't affect directly. The barriers of silver crystal and those near it are beyond its abilities. I see. That's why nothing happened to my home and stuff like that. So, since my fate and the silver crystal had been apart for so long... They were able to change my destiny. Then come for us too! We traveled abroad and go to the past, away from Juban! And we know that destinies haven't changed directly, but we can't stay the same with our friends and family! Oh, then my house... Yes, it's possible if these changes keep accumulating. The end result of the destiny changes too. What are you saying about that? What do I do? I've got to get back home. Is it okay if I join you? Sure. Yeah, but you are the Grim Reaper. Satsuna, would you come with us too? Very well. I, I can't see the kind of the path of those, huh? I gotta check on him. Right, let's see what happens with me and Hikawa Shrine. That sounds like a good idea, comrade. I'll head back to my place too. I need more vodka. Lead the way, Haruka. Count on this! Rush over! Bye, Osagi! All right, we better get going, too. Maru, we're leaving now. Please get some more rest. I'm on my way now. Please be there if anything happens. Take care, Okao. Uh, Us Usagi. Usagi. Sorry, must must have been like a translate. Must have been an edit error. Chapter 5! After the battle. Alright, uh... Well, I got some decent amount of cash. Uh... Yeah, I feel like I probably should not have done this LP, like... I mean, I'm, it's fine and all, and I'm glad Huey gets with me right now, but, uh...
Yeah. But, uh... Oops, I do Oh, yeah, something that also happened recently. So, uh... Yesterday, they finally released the new, uh... What is it? The, the Solid Snake skin for Fortnite. Oh. Uh, do you not know that? I mean, I'm sure you've heard no. of Fortnite, because it's, like, literally one of the most popular games to ever happen, ever, of all time. Uh... I remember, like, because, uh, I mean, they, I, I think I told you about this before, that they actually had a, uh, a massive crossover with Marvel. Oh, yeah. You told me about the space balls. Oh, yeah, right. Apparently people compare, I have not seen the Marvels and probably never will. But, but it's uh, coming up on next month's Disney Plus. Uh, which but... I, which my family has not renewed. Probably blessing. I'm sure you get that fixed. Uh, I doubt but it, I but like I said, you... there is a crossover with, uh... But, uh, apparently I watched the honest trailer for that for the marvels where there's like a subplot about trying to suffocate trying to get a lot of the air from a planet uh-huh well i got you unfortunately saw that movie can you explain that that was from guardians of the galaxy they can't breathe in space no air i, I mean can you explain the whole uh what the village motive in uh the it's the marvels was the yeah, it was like, about so, those three teaming up together against... No, I meant, like, the villain. Like, what was the, the goal of the villain? What was he trying to do? Darvin? The main villain of that movie. All I know, something about removing yeah. the Earth's atmosphere's air. You mean the sun? She was trying to do that. That's literally the plot of Spaceballs. And she's wearing one of the bracelets that looks like Miss Marvel's. Uh-huh. That All bracelet. Right, uh, so, yeah, that happened there. All right, uh... Well, good news. More dialogue. Phew. That's a relief. Everything's the same here. Uh. And, yep, their parents are not here. Uh, the teacher probably does something. Uh. So far, so good. Uh, no sign of, a. Uh, and that, well, time to do what we do. We've done all the time with this shit. Every time we visit Shingo, we're going to interrupt his Minecraft session. Which one is his bedroom? I know. There it is. Get the... What the... Usagi! I was... Busy. I was literally about to play Minecraft. Don't barge in there like that. Ch Chibi Yusa, what's wrong? It's like the strike of the body's waking somehow. What's that animal? Shingo, get away from that thing! Forget it, Sailor Moon. You'll get it, Sailor Moon. This boy belongs to us now. If you want him back, hand over the legendary silver crystal. That voice! Sin, it's you, isn't it? Shingo has nothing to do with this. Let him go! Oh, even the marvelous Miss Sailor Moon is scared when her little brother's involved. Let him go. Wait, does Shingo know he, that's Usagi Sailor Moon? Like, this part in the... I already outlined a turn. Don't get him back if you give us the silver crystal. Then you have a little brother named Anshar, don't you? Then you should know how important Shingo is to her. Yeah, I know exactly how you feel. That's why I did it. Horrible. Why are you so intent on getting the silver crystal? Because it makes death to the destiny we wish for impossible. And 
Just what is this future you desire so much that you would alter destiny? Fine, I'll clue you in. The world we dream of would be, have no wars caused by the Silver Crystal. It's one without a royal family of the White Moon. What are you talking about? Isn't this crystal going to save Earth? No, is that so? Did the Black Moon reject purification by the Silver Crystal? Was it the Dark Kingdom's main ambition to take it? I... If you don't want to hand over the crystal, we'll hold on to the boy. I hope you reconsider this after all. My life, his life is in my hands. Shingo? Wasagi, Chibiusa is in danger! We have to defeat the final creature! Transform! Moon Cosmic Power! <sighs> yeah, I'm a little stuffed up right now. Ooh. Sorry, uh... Okay, let's see, uh... Hopefully, that this thing isn't gonna be in a pain in the ass to... To beat the crap out of. Uh... Ooh, that... I like those... I like those odds. So, uh... <gasps> uh... But yeah, like I said, apparently people thought that the whole subplot involving, like, trying, like, to remove all the Earth's oxygen was very similar to a move to the movie Spaceballs. Mm. I tell you, if the villain wanted to succeed, they could have just checked the... One, two, three, four, five. Do you not get that reference? No. Okay. So in Spaceballs, the main villains, the titular Spaceballs, were trying to, to capture a, uh, trying to get all the er, all the oxygen from another planet called Druidia. That was a thank you for not being a pain in the ass, boss. Shingo? Usagi! Harukun! And Michiru are here! Hmm, well, Usagi is a bit tied up at the moment. Please send them upstairs. She saw some pretty. She shot some really weird shit in Shingo's Minecraft server. Probably weird shit part of him with her. So, have you found anything ab out of the ordinary? The enemy was here. They kidnapped Shingo, her little brother. What about you two? Well, some of these, that wasn't a member of the racing team yet. Wait, is she like, is that like her profession? Like she's like a professional racer or something? Yeah. She probably plays a lot of Gran Turismo then. You know what that is? No. It's a it's a racing game that's like known for being like a very realistic like how at cars would actually drive in real life. Apparently, recently Sony announced. I'll probably say that for later. My favorite violin has vanished, and when I tried to buy another, the shop was all sold out. It looks like we have various problems, but for now, let's reconvene at Hikara Shrine. All right, Usagi. Shingo. Guys, I'm sorry. If I came across the enemy right now, I wouldn't be able to fight. Shingo's. We understand. Both you and Small Lady are in no condition to fight. I'm sorry. Please, go on ahead. I'll carry Chibiusa on my back. Let's get going. Alright, so as I said beforehand, uh, 
Basically, the villains are trying to get all the planet, for, the oxygen from another planet called Druidia, because their favorite is basically running out low on theirs. Or maybe President Spaceball was hoarding it because he's an asshole. But basically, what happened is that he was hoarding all of the Earth's all of the oxygen of a uh, planet Spaceball. Uh. Uh, and basically, they try, they end up like kidnapping, capturing the princess of uh, Druidia and uh, Spaceball. That was one of the '80s movies. Yeah, it was. So as I said, I was trying to explain the plot to you. So basically, they try to get the. So they end up asking for the code to access the oxygen of Planet, of planet Geridia. And the key, the code? One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, yeah, that's literally the code. One, two, three, four, five. And they, they're like, that's something that some idiot would put on their luggage. Because obviously that's like not a very helpful. That's not a very hard code to crack. So then, basically, when President Spaceball comes back, he says, "When I tell him the code, he says, I can't believe it! I have the same pa password on my luggage." Uh. <laughs> yeah, because it point out, of course. Yeah, I'm trying to remember where. Oh yeah, it's here we are. Shrine. Okay. Oh, uh, was that the right entrance? Uh, I haven't played this game in weeks. I haven't. I literally spent the entirety of the past few days trying to edit videos. It seems everyone is here. Is it true they got she go? Yeah. They avoid us for the future. It always to the future, it's more like a train. Shingo's life is at stake. Even if it is a trap, I'm going. But it's a bit dangerous to go without knowing about the enemy. You're right, but we can't just stay here and twiddle our thumbs. I've made up my mind. Masaki! Let's go to the future! Ba, ba, da, 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 da. Decided. I can't do the Back to the Future theme. I will guide us to the door of space and time. Right, uh... Everyone, please wait. Uh, long time to see, Mamoru. Who the heck is this? Mm -mm. Okay, then. <gasps> Fjord! Mm -hmm. We meet again. I have to thank abs that absolutely. Why have you shown yourself before me again? That absolute lady told me everything about an unhappy destiny. That's not true, Fior. He's right. You're being deceived. Deceived? Very well might be. But she has enough power to bring me back to life. Surely, Mamoru and I, the future. Sir Moon, hurry, hurry on ahead! Huh? Why? Oh! Let's all turn it into a field of flowers. It seems he's intent on keeping you from going to the future. You need to go on without me. I'll catch up with you after I defeat Fior. Understood! Oi! Hey, Sailor Moon, let's go. Why well, should but save you tuxedo mask? Tuxedo mask! Hey, that's my Sorry, life. sorry, 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 honey. I won't let you go. Get my way, Bob. Fjord! 
Do I have to fight you after all? Tuxedo Mask, please don't die. Oh, Crystal Pianist! Oh my god, acid tripping! What's going on? It's wavering like a mirage. They're, they're starting to change. Let's only absolutely got her hand that she got one of the rainbow crystals. Shingo! You cowards! Give Shingo back right now! If you want him back, come to the Fortress of Shadows. That's where we're holding your adorable brother. Uh, that's definitely not creepy at all. But Amsar's pretty impatient, you know. Just look at the palace, it might already be too late. That's it all. If you're all sorts of fight this fan and scan combat. You want fair? Fine. We can give you a little hint. I'm the type whose valuable efficiency. You get two choices. Sacrifice Shingo Tsukino to go after the queen. Or sacrifice the queen and save Shingo Tsukino. Which will you choose? Oh, go ahead. Pick whatever you like best. Which poor little thing will you abandon? Sailor Mercury, Sailor Mars, Sailor Jupiter, Sailor Venus. If you want to settle things with us, come to the Fortress of Shadows. We'll be looking forward to it. Shingo! Why is it a star space? Where would else go? So may we allow. Look at this space. So let's leave them. Opposite sol opposite soldiers. Show yourselves. So you figured it out? Well, I guess it's only natural. It's the second time you've been in this space. Cry all you want. No one's going to help you. You cry. Bastard. Have been cast in s aside. That is not the rule. You tried to load me with an illusion. Are you sure? Don't you all really want a destiny where you don't need a fight? Yeah, yeah. So stop fighting us, okay? We have a lovely destiny for you. Oh, Dad! Mom, too! It's something the matter! It's rare to see you two together! Oh, really? You're gonna remind that kiddo? How about joining your mom and dad for dinner? You know she can. It's her wedding at a festival, remember? <sighs> How could I forget? Sorry about that, honey. Oh, don't worry about that, Father! I don't go to dinner! I want my lunch! Mamoru! What's up? You're paying off the affection after the sudden. Don't worry, something Bunhead was looking for you again. Aw, she'll be alright. Let's talk about our plans for today instead. Where you wanna go? Mm -hmm. Maybe your room? <sighs> but there's nothing to do in my room. I don't even have an Xbox. It's okay. Let's get going. Oh my god, it Mamoru cheating on his stocking? What a twist! Uh -oh. That's what a twist! A dream. I know! <sighs> Sweet it! 
Why? What up, Wanka? We all love it, do we? I didn't blame you. Well, why? Big Ted Gary was looking for you earlier. All right, Saki. And I guess we'll drop a line later. But not about her. What, what, what day's box match? Fantastic as usual. For such a tall chick, you make one hell of a mile. <laughs> Call me a tall chick again. <laughs> Sorry. How you doing there? What about you? Wait, hey. Uh, excuse me. Huh? Do I know you? My name is Minako Aino. Here, read this. Hikaru, I did it. I gave Minami my love letter. What did he say? Uh, I kind of ran off before he could say anything. Mina, what the hell are you thinking? Jesus. What, well, brother? Disco Jesus, like, uh, er, Disco Jesus, what are you doing in hell? I don't know, brother. <laughs> How was it? Now let's stop fighting. There would be no merit in battling further. What do you intend to do? Are you dumb enough to let your destinies go to waste because of Sailor Moon? Have you ever thought that becoming Sailor Soldiers wasn't what you wanted? Come on, revert your transformations. A destiny of your deepest desire awaits you, if you do. You're right, that might be everything. Right, right, right. Aye, no join it. You already made my choice. So I should fight alongside Santa Moon. If it weren't for her, we may all still be alone. She brought us all together! Let's think about our lives. Think of Santa Moon. We will fight! I wonder how long you'll keep spouting such nonsense, idiot. You're wasting an incredible chance. Just give up and say hello to happiness. Hmm. I expected no less of the sailor soldiers. Well then, I look forward to our showdown in the Fortress of Shadows. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. I have to do the TF2 laugh. Hang in there, girls. What happened? Sarah Moon. That was scary. You all just collapsed out of the blue. But the enemy attacked us. It says they were caught off guard. Don't worry, though. You're gonna have to get to do better to trick us. Well said, lady. Jupiter. Chaos! But... What's wrong now? It's despicable how they took both the Queen and Shingo hostage. I can't choose one over the other. We have to save them both. Also, it's kind of weird how we haven't... Like, sh I, I know it's like that Shingo hasn't really had much to do with the story... I go on. We'll go up to the Queen of Fast. The enemy doesn't want to suffice to come back. Soon we can't the traps in the circle of surprise, right? We gotta go find the way out of But Shingo's life is in danger. We can save him first, then go help the Queen. But something may happen to the Queen in the meantime. Who's to say they aren't simply waiting for an opening to attack the palace? Damn, damn. Tiny drum truck like this. We should split up again. You're yeah, right. It's the only option. Okay, who's going with who? I'm going to rescue Shingo. Besides, it's not like I can go meet my future self. I gotta go out the mobby. What about the rest of you? I'm going with you. I want to sell things up with Nurgle, who awaits us on Dread Isle. I think Venus, Mercury, and Jupiter feel the same. I right, come with me. Got some more fish to do with that Murdoch wanker. For me, it's that crazy Ishtar. 
And now move for me! Well, you got either of them eventually. We got to go either of them eventually, comrades. Uh. Agree. Both situations are representable. Send me along with small lady. Me too. Alright, uh... Well, basically, we can actually just pick whoever he wants. I'm picking a guide again. Uh... Take Sailor Mars. Uh, don't worry, I'm... Like I said, uh... <laughs> All right, uh... Say hi to the queen for me. And stay on your guard, Chibi Moon. Don't get sloppy. That's for sure. Say for your Sailor Moon. <laughs> right. Okay, we're off. Nothing's gonna stop us. Sailor Moon, be careful. Uh. So where does that leave us? I'm going with Chibi Moon. Then I'll go with. Then I'll take Sailor Moon's side. We're gonna go finish the missions. Then we'll do a space time. Take care, Artemis, honey. Yeah, you too. It seems the Sailor Soldiers are headed this way. Yet, if my destiny runs its original course, my life will be. For fate come the morrow. Forfeit. I think it's forfeit. Forfeit come to. I will amend it without fail and become the Silver Crystal's successor. With the power to change destiny and the power of the crystal in my hands, I can become the Queen of Eternity. Lady Apsu. It seems the Sailor Scouts have split off into two groups. This matters little so long as my ceremony sees no interference. Offer yourselves as a diversion. Understood. The ceremony will be conducted in the Tower of Space Time. Fiora's got self fighting tuxedo mask on the middle floor. Or at least trying to. Then have Amshar release the seal on the direct path to the tower. Uh, as you wish. Soon, child. Soon the world will you desire will be upon us. Okay. So, uh... A world where you and your brother can live in peace. Thank you so much. Make haste. Deliver, Make haste so deliver onto me the silver crystal. <sighs> Normally, I went in the answer here, but there's so much dialogue there that, uh. Uh. Uh, it's your turn. Shingo, please be okay. I'm coming. All right, yeah, we got it. Because if you already can't tell, the other girls are very underleveled.
Uh... Oh yeah, I don't think I actually finished talking about this uh, Fortnite. So basically, they finally added a snake from Metal Gear Solid into Fortnite. Hmm. Uh, but to my shock, I thought it was just gonna be Snake, but they did add like Snake's version, Snake's uh, look from when he appeared in Metal Gear Solid 4, or Old Man Snake is what fans like to call him. Uh. And they also, uh, but not. They also added another character from Your Solids. Well, planning to anyway. Riot in from Metal Gear Solid 2. I'm a little disappointed that it's not Metal Gear Solid uh, Rise, Metal Gear Rising Revenge, and Knuckles featuring Dante Raiden. <laughs> Do you not get that? Yes. The and Knuckles featuring Dante meme? Mm, okay, no. so, uh. There's a game, so there was a game called Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne that came out on, uh, that basically it was a friend game, like, or trying, like, we're basically fighting against demons and angels, like, in a post apocalyptic in Tokyo. And, uh, however, when the game came out in, uh, In Europe, there was like, there was like a weird tech, there was like a bit of a sticker on it. Basically, the third game had Dante, a character from a game called Don't May Cry, as like a, as a character that played a somewhat minor role in the overall story. And when the game came out here in America, I mean, it came out in Europe, which was the publisher's first games of two. Uh... There was a big tag on the sticker that read, Featuring Dante from Delvey Christ series. It, granted, this was the publisher, the European publisher's first game, but a lot of people made fun of this for just, uh, since Dante wasn't even, like, a, played a big role in the overall story. The, so basically, a lot of people like to put, put a meme of Dante this beat put a bunch of images of the cover reading and knuckles featuring Dante despite even though Dante would obviously not be in the game Um, but I write it as for the end, Knuckles is from a game song. Knuckles, I don't know what spiraled that into becoming a meme. I think mean, the Dante one, it's obvious. But, uh, can any beam expert explain the...
Oh. What happened? Nothing. Finally. Yeah, yeah like I said, uh, Jupiter monster. is uh, very underleveled, and uh, hopefully that'll be enough to 